I'm Rodrigo Quintero. I work in Cemex. We're one of the leading manufacturers for cement ready mix and aggregates. We have annual sales of close to $14 billion. All the new engineers, all the young engineers coming out of school, they are more data ready and they do everything digitally very easy. So they are just doing everything as, they, as possible in Pi, including new tools from Seek, uh, Tableau, Power BI, you name it. I mean, it, it doesn't matter which tool you use. Create insight, make better business decisions, improve your process, improve your day-to-day -day activities. And in all of this, Pi is the foundation of everything. First, we started with forecasting and predicting process uh, behavior. And after that, let's uh, give prescriptive recommendations to our cement operator, to the kiln operator. So seeing that the equipment was responding correctly and that the forecast of how the equipment was going to, to behave, we said, okay, let's go all the way in and let's send those recommendations directly to the control system. It was a really exhilarating experience to see uh, once you turn that uh, autopilot, as we call it, on, how it started to operate the system for you. It was uh, an amazing experience, I can say. I mean, for us in Cemex and probably in the industry, it was the first time that you can do something like that. This is like when uh, the steam engine first came to play. And then the same happened with the electrical motor. And then the same happened with computers. The technology is here to stay. It's probably going to change the way we work, but it's here to make our life easier. To replicate the golden days of operation when we have the best performance and to make it repeatable every single day. It takes time, the change management is crucial for these uh, new technologies when they come into play. But I think we're in the right path and we're very excited about being there. I think these are very exciting times to be working with this technology. I am Rodrigo Quintero and that's my Pi story.